Hello everyone, this is Yavin and in this tutorial I am going to show you how you can install Angular in your device. So this is really simple. So first of all, before we install Angular, we need to have Node.js installed in our device. So in order to check whether you have Node.js installed or not, just go to your Windows search bar and then search for CMD and there you can see common prompt. Click on it, then it will open a common prompt and here you need to say here Node minus minus version then press enter and it will show you the node.js version if node.js is installed in your device so if you do not have installed node.js just go to google then you need to search over here node.js then press enter then you will see this link node.js.org just click here and then you will see this download option so if you do not have node.js download or install then you need to install it for gap. So I'll assume that you already have Node.js installed and if you do not have Node.js installed, I already make a tutorial on how you can install Node.js. You can check out that video. So right now I want to assume that you already have Node.js installed. So after installing Node.js, you are ready to install Angular. So in order to install Angular, you just need to go to your command prompt and then you need to write a command which is npl then you need to say install minus g minus g means global global means it will globally install angular in your device so you'll be able to create project anywhere you want so after that you need to say here at the top angular slash cli so you need to write this command npm install minus g angular slash cli then press enter so this will start installing angular in our device globally. So this may take some time. So I will just fast forward the video. So there you can see angular is installed in our device. So right now what we need to do is we need to create an angular project. So for it, let me just go to a folder location. Let me just go to new volume D over here. And let's say here we are going to create a angular projects so in order to do that we need to open a command prompt in this directory so here i'm just going to click at the top okay. then right here cmd then press enter so it will open a command prompt so here in order to create a angular project we need to say first ng new and after that we need to give our project a name let's say my first angular so those two lines, I, I mean those two are is for creating a project and this will be our project name. So if we now press enter, it will create an angular project and that project name will be my first angular. So let me just press enter. So here it will ask you a question that would you like to share usage data about this project? We'll just say here no, then press enter. And then you need to choose which option you would like to use do you want to use css sss and sss intended and less so you can just control it by using the windows arrow key so i'm going to choose css so just go to css and press enter after that do you want a server size rendering i'll say no and press enter and there you go it started creating our angular project so this will take like five minutes to install and there you can see our angular project is created so right now we need to run our project and there you can see we are in the d directory so we need to go to our project directory so we can just close this common prompt because we already created our project so let's just close this and the previous on as well so if we just go down here you can see my first angular a folder is created and if we go inside there you can see we have some folders and files and at the top you can see the project location or directory so we need to click here then it says cmd then press enter then it will open a command prompt so in order to run our this project we just need to say ng serve and press enter and there you can see our project is running so in order to open the project in the browser we need to copy this so we need to copy this then go to our browser paste it if we now press enter there you can see our angular project is created 
and let's say if you want to change the text from here you can do it as well let me just open it using sublime text you can use any code editor so i'm going to use sublime text i'm going to click file then open folder and our project was in the new volume d and its name was my first angular this one and click on it then click select folder and there you can see it opened so we'll move to our source file then we'll go to our app in the app there you can see app.component.html so you can modify it anything from here so for example here you can see main class main content i'm just going to remove everything from here and let's just say here hello world if we now save it then here you can see it is saying over here hello world so we are able to successfully install angular and create angular project i hope this tutorial was useful to you if you have any question or suggestion just let me know in the comment section make sure to subscribe and i hope to see you in the future tutorials